Cancer zodiac tarot card messages for today. Cancer love tarot, daily love tarot, and this is one for you for today. Cancer, whoa, okay. That is also a sign that for for your angels are saying that there's the energy of an ex that's grieving. All right, that's going through a realization of what they've lost and they don't want to be with you without you. All right, so your first card is judgment. So someone wants to come around to be real with you, to speak some truth, to be authentic, to be open, to show you their true colors, their true feelings. This person, they've been reading you, watching you, or studying you. Yeah, the strength card. I feel like this person is feeling like you are a strong one, like you are the answer to their key, or you have master key energies, you have Christ consciousness energy. This someone is getting to it's just a realization with the strength card. I hear of your dominance and you are winning. You're getting something your way, you're getting what you want. Someone is wanting you, waning. All right, so the, the energy of someone realizing that they've really lost you, who is a true one, like they had a chance to be with an angel, and angels are rare, and they messed it up. They didn't realize like that you were this magnificent, magical, abundant, alluring, strong, powerful creature, mystical creature, um, graceful, amazing, unique, uh, special, one of a kind, one in a million creature. They didn't realize that that is what they had. Power, trust. Now they want to, I hear, compromise. Now they want to come and give you everything. Now they want to lay it all on the table. Someone wants to go down. So, um, this person, they want to leave some, this someone also wants to leave someone to be with you. Yeah, they, they're thinking about you. They want to send you a message. But before they leave someone to be with you, they want to call you first. They want to hear what you say. Because this person would be, like, here if you're open, this person would be willing to end a connection that they've been in for, like, three or eight years or 11 years or two years to come toward you, number three, to have a new beginning with you, three, three. Because this person is feeling like you float their boat, you rock their boat, you, um, something about your ancestors, you delight them. Alright, they feel like you are something that, um, they can move toward, you're, you're worth it. You, you're worth the journey. This person could be Sagittarius, something about demon. Oh my, the king of wands energy. Yes, someone is watching you. A lot they look at you a lot this person they're wanting you very much they are jealous of you as well this person they want to make your dreams come true they're jealous obsessed are like upset frustrated over your energy king of wands this is feeling like a, a deep crush or just a lot of feelings this like loyalty to your to your to the feelings that they have for you like they they're upset too like they don't want to see someone else getting close to you talking to you up type of way it makes this person upset jealous triggered because they choose you already you're the one that someone is wanting there's something going on with your family let's see maybe some a past person eight number eight or a scorpio number five family energies what's going on with your family cancer <clears throat> let's see something about a book or your history number 26 number eight number eight could be significant could be a birth month august maybe significant and um someone wants to reach out to you maybe someone's name is august or maybe someone wants to reach out to you in summer Yes, yeah, someone wants to reach out to you in summer with an offer a proposal for an, a new beginning with them so I feel like in in summer you're going to be in a in a relationship, a connection. Like you're gonna have a partner, someone to take your hand, or some reunion or reconciliation with a lost connection to loved ones. All right, you're gonna. I feel happiness and bountiful feelings of happiness surrounding you. 
your roots, your family, your loved one, your significant other. Both of you see that some, something was painful. You're choosing to look past that, to look deeper. Both of you are going to be connecting really deeply, looking toward abundance, multiplication of wealth, of loved ones, of family life. Both of you creating history together and your loved ones are around you, your past loved ones. They they say Sila. They want to know what you need. Some of them are warning you about a family member or a person that you knew when you were growing up. Number five, maybe significant or a Pisces. Maybe this person is born me. Um, you are also separated from this anyone that would do ill to you, anyone that wanna like attach to your energy. That's like trying to drain from your energy in some way. Maybe even a person you you knew from your younger days growing up. Like the spirits are saying, you're going to be healed from any love spells, binds with a Sagittarius. Yeah, yeah, you're going to be cutting some cords. You're going to be distancing from all kind of, you know, king of wands energy that one and magician energy that wanted to bind to you energetically. Um, and they're also, they've also been using your energy. Yes. Yeah, so if people are going to be facing karma and removed from your life, you are not going to be feeling any pain. You're going to be feeling more free, more delightful, more high on life, like a balloon that has been given more length, like a kite that is taking more space because you're being free from karmic energies or exes or friends or family members, people that were trying to bind themselves in your energy in some way. Some of them hooked on you in many different ways. Some, some of them wanted you to like forever be in some agreement with them energetically, spiritually, 733. But they cannot have you. Some people that never wanted to let you go. Some people that didn't want you to change, have a new beginning for any reason at all. Some people thought that they could control you, have power over your life, where you go. So you're, if, so you're not going to go here. You're, uh, this is where you're going to go instead. And using magic to do so, those people are going to be cut out of your life. So you're going to be more free. Yeah, these karmics are being revealed. They are not angels. They are not of your kin they are snakes you're not you're not that type of a snake yeah you are more like mm, 33 i don't know in the reverse number nine yeah i feel like you're an, you're an earth angel you're a light worker number 11 number two yeah and you're meeting another light worker number seven energies that's a deep dreamer deep thinker and this person is thinking about you a lot this person is really thinking more recently of how to get closer to you. This song is playing in my head. Closer to you. Mm. <laughs> Why are you doing that? This person could be psychic, telepathic, mind reader. They send you messages. They think about you a lot. They look up on the stars. They may be hoping of collaborating with you, working with you, marrying you. Number seven energies are very highly significant here. Um, prosperity, marriages, um, and love, uh, and daydreaming. This person, they want to keep you safe from any perpetrator at all. They want to protect you, defend you, any perpetrator from your past, present, or even your current. Yeah, this person, they want to have, like, make a promise to you for good energies, stability, foundation, creation, being there for you, supporting you, loving you emotionally spiritually physically because there's someone that can feel like you haven't been catered to that way in your in your life in your relationships they may feel like you've come across a lot of indignation or like people that wanted to you know take you for granted along your journey take your beautiful energy for granted so this person they are so mad at anybody in your past, anyone from your past that treated you wrong and they're so upset that someone has made you this this person now that you're not trusting in others and you're upset, you're hurt and this person they so that someone just wants to come in and change your life for the better. They want to remind you of your magic ten of diamonds. So keep speaking about this person. Keep believing in them. They are real. Ten of Diamonds is a miracle. 
deja vu twin flame love at first sight dream come true dream life a realization of love life transformations taking place for you that is an energy that i am visualizing happening in your life a an amazing wealthy healthy connection with a twin flame that is about to be revealed number 28 maybe significant number 28 number 10 number one um you may also have the spirit of your exes around you the a k word or a b word or the something all right so this person they want to show up moon card hidden enemies you have enemies that i hear hexes around you they leave things around you secretly and these are exes as well yeah People that are in lover's card in reverse. People that wanted to be with you. And they secretly they secretly did something with like yeah, karmic energies, magic and spells. And this person thought that they would get away with it. You would never find out. Eleven eleven. They never knew you had a great grandmother number four. Or you are a grandmaster yourself. Or 11-11, you're really just connected in high spirits to your higher self. Number one again, you're going to get a new man or a new woman in your life. When that happens, this snake, someone may even try to tarnish your name. This snake may show up, this vile thing. This could be a lizard, a snake, a, a reptilian energy. In some ways, a shapeshifter, someone disguising themselves, 1222 energy to get your information, to get in your mind. Someone trying to come around like they're good, but they are not. Um, so you are like you are a protective fighter angel. You are an angel, a warrior angel of light. You come to disseminate and to destroy the darkness is the energy, the illusions, the trickery, the low vibrations. You come to expose them. That's probably why you got so much fight in your life. And sometimes that's why you feel tired. So you need to replenish. <clears throat> Someone also does not want you to find love, to intertwine with love. Because they know you're going to be more powerful when you find that right connection. That right other half. That is like source to you also. Like a plug to your socket. That both of you will help each other to grow to level up to develop spiritually financially etc it will be like an it will be like undefeatable energies that both of you create spiritually like your fences will be stronger you're also going to be having a family with this person that's this great person that is coming in yeah, so someone from your past they didn't want you to know yourself or to be aware number 22 in the reverse Number six, so you could be dealing with a cancer and a Virgo energy, but you are protected by a family member on the other side. Number three, that is telling you everything. Number five, there's something going on in your stomach, your navel string. It may have something to do with youths or something about your childhood or you're going to be carrying ch children. Number four, energy. Yeah, someone wants to heal with you. Someone charmed you. Someone was your tw a fake twin flame they just acted like they were the one, but they were not. Now you are moving on. Number 11, number 2 energy. You're choosing yourself. You're choosing your divine energies. Number 7. And connecting with greater spirits and manifesting this beautiful person that is literally of yourself. Number 2, 2-2 two, two energy. All right, they're, they're, the other ones cannot get in your energy anymore. So they try to spy. They're lurking. And they're trying to send someone that they think they're trying to send someone back to you or someone wants to come back to you that's not the, that's not the exact one for you but you're intuitive and you're gonna know you're gonna sense this out so whatever blockages they were trying to send your way or veil put over your eyes or illusions for you to think that someone is for you but they are not you're going to see the truth you're going to make the right choice you're going to choose the person that is for you it's how I'm feeling. Yeah, you're not going to make the wrong choice. And someone is not going to make the wrong choice in choosing you either. Right? Match made in heaven that someone could not mash up or destroy. 
and so people were competing with you to see if they can do better than you in love for some reason yeah we have like success we have babies coming we have great changes new cycles your best self being lifted up your energy being protected like great changes coming up for you this is reminding me of a protection that Dorothy from the Wizard of Oz had she had like a divine goddess protection or something like that around her someone supported her dreams even though it felt like she was going in a risky place so you're about to take a leap of faith so nine of diamonds um i'm seeing wealth around you i'm seeing a ring a message messages number nine energies someone is asking about a new beginning with you that's what they want for some of you someone wants to take a break page of wands Maybe someone wants to take a break to see you. Someone wants to take a break from something. Let's see. Page of Swords. Like someone wants to take a break from watching watching you or spying. I don't know. Yeah, the snake. The snake energy. This enemy. They watch your your home, your house, your life, your father, your your. They know that this is the real one. This is the one that's coming in for you. 